Assalamualaikum and hello YouTube. My name is Nur Muhammad from Anywatch and I'm back with another One Watch 5 Looks. Right, so the subject for today's strap fashion show is my Carnival 19... Was it 1986? Right, right Carnival 1986 3TM watch. So I've got this a few years back, I think th two or three years, uh, three years already. Already. So for those who do who didn't know, Carnival is an AliExpress brand. So you can easily find this somewhere around. I think I've bought this for, for about seventy bucks. So I think now you could easily get this for about fifty to sixty bucks. For, and for that, and for the money, I think it is an awesome value for value for money because this one has three tm right so of course it features this 40 millimeters in diameter uh luck to luck of about 49 millimeters and it features this uh, a, a luck width is 20 millimeters and it features this awesome carbon fiber looking dial right so if you don't like this dial of course they had another a few different options i think they, they've got white black I, I can't remember if they've got any green dial uh, do check out AliExpress page for this one, but I've had this for three years now. It is, it is featuring a quartz ronda movement, supposedly. <laughs> I have no idea. I haven't opened the case back yet, but it's supposed to have a ronda quartz movement, and it has it has been taken away for the past three years without any issues. And sometimes the quartz hand does hit the mark sometimes it does not i don't really care because it is my go anywhere do anything type of watch right so now of course the whole the whole goal of this particular uh one watch five look is that so is so that i can give you an idea right so an idea of how to make your old watch looks new every now and then right so of course in this time of it's of pandemic situation you don't really want to buy another new watch just to have that new look so what you can do is you can just swap out a few different straps so that you can have that new look a new watch look for in you know every day or even every week or even every month depending on your situation right so this watch originally comes on a stainless steel bracelet with a butterfly clasp which I absolutely hate and that is why I've never really put the watch this particular watch on that bracelet and I have been using it on aftermarket ever, ever since I've got it in right so first up is this super duper cool red shiny super shiny color um, red strap uh, I can't remember the name of this particular version uh, but yeah it is supplied from lovewatchstrap.com a company that I've been using I've, I've got tons of different strap from them for, for the past few years and this is one of their latest creation check out that zigzag pattern here and the thickness is just about 1.3 millimeters and this is a single pass strap and yeah that makes it oh the thickness of this thing is just 11 millimeters so when you add just one millimeters on the under the side the case back it doesn't really it doesn't really feel that thick on your wrist right so nicely stitch no nicely um hit seal hole here with a uh, circular holes here and nicely hit seal uh, end of the strap which prevents it from fraying and at this other end it features this adjustable length adjustable system where you can uh, adjust it according to your wrist size so yeah this is of course we have that love uh, watch strap logo which is the uh, one piece logo uh, from the anime uh, one piece right oh the love logo or is it luffy <laughs> luffy logo on uh, on the uh, one piece anime right so let's put this on the wrist put this thing on the wrist and let's see oh before we do that let's do a quick wrist watch chat today i am wearing the steel dive squally homage malaysia uh, sorry micro brand Mala uh, micro brand watches malaysia special edition 2020 covid diver 20 atmos wow <laughs> that is a very very long watch guys so anyway i've done a an, an unboxing video for this particular piece just a limit super limited edition of 14 uh, pieces or 40 pieces exclusively made for our mwm facebook group group here based in malaysia i will be doing a full review for this particular piece so stay tuned right so i'm spotting this on this um super adjustable uh, needle strap from how oh, man i can't remember yeah spring drive right spring dive or it was it spring i can't remember but yeah i, I will leave a link to this to this uh, strap maker 
was it spring spring nato <laughs> anyway so let's take it off and put the um put this carnival 3tm watch on my wrist my, if i haven't mentioned it already my wrist is 6.75 inch wrist so the luck to look off oh but about 14 millimeters does not uh, look that that bad on my wrist so no problems there and yes because this one features an, a, a, an adjustable buckle system that is why i have just uh, just enough remain on this uh, fixed buckle uh, sorry fixed keeper here and this there is an a movable keeper should you need but should you need you need it but i don't really need it right, and that red color plays really really nice with that um what do you call this uh with this carbon fiber pattern dial and of course this one featuring a sapphire crystal with a little bit of anti-reflective coating and this is a fixed ceramic bezel insert right so this is strap number one check out that shiny red color and let's go to strap number two this is another strap maker from singapore this uh this is from rsmwatchstrap.com <laughs> but of course i will give you guys the link later on and this features uh, i don't really know i can't remember the name of this particular strap but the different the nylon material is a bit different so it's a bit more coarse but not that it won't hurt hurt your wrist it's still soft and supple but it has this um recessed um recess or concave or <laughs> let's just call it recess area at the middle of the strap and uh somehow it re it reinforces the uh holes on this uh pad on this strap right so very very nice and super soft and supple material yeah, very very unique i must say and of course it features the almost similar uh, adjustable pet adjustable buckle that it was used on the love watch strap but again we have this uh, brush buckle with the rsm where the walrus logo right so this strap is of course similarly a single piece strap and it's a bit longer compared to the ones that came from the love watch strap but very very nicely done uh, they also have um tons of other colorway i think they've got khaki they've got blue with the uh, red red middle red red color inside so tons of different options for you to choose from and for me this looks absolutely nice i just love this dark gray color it has that a bit a tinge of blue a tinge of dark gray tinge, tinge of black and for me this looks absolutely <laughs> badass and when i compare when i pair it with this uh, carbon fiber dial uh, carnival tritium wash right so let's go to strap number three or vintage bond colorway uh, uh, seat belt neto strap or the i think alf blue shark call this alpha shark premier uh, alpha shark premier line alpha shark premier strap so it features this <laughs> very very nice uh, 1.2 millimeters in thickness super duper soft and supple um material here and check out that zigzag pattern right oh i just love this black and red and green and it can it it still has that sheen of shininess to it and these they have uh you know what some blue shark is the ones that started this um rectangular style holes which is not my favorite but still it is still holding up no fraying whatsoever on this particular strap and uh, of course this one features a two-piece uh, style so we have where we have these two uh two piece of material down the watch but because the thinness or and the softness of the material it doesn't really add that much of a height of height to the watch itself right so we have a fixed keeper here and a movable keeper keeper in the middle and we have a blue shark sign brush buckle up top and let's see how it looks on my 6.75 inch wrist right so let's just pause this thing okay if i can do it oh now i'm not gonna be pausing right okay so okay so you can see that i that you can see that the long strap means that you can i think someone with about six point maybe six and a quarter inches and up to eight inches or even eight and a half inches could use this strap and because of there are tons of material left so i can just uh put it inside this movable keeper here and i can just tuck it uh, adjust it using this uh i just tuck in nicely using this uh, movable keeper here damn 
long strap but not a problem for me uh, yeah it's, it's better to have a longer strap than a shorter one right all right so this is how <laughs> this uh, blue shark vintage ponytail looks on my 6.75 inch wrist right so let's go to strap number four which is the paratrooper strap from cheapestnatostraps.com so this one featuring an this elastic uh, elastic style strap but with a single piece so it is not a double piece or triple piece like we used to we used to see from Erika's or MNN or some of something like similar to that one but it features this simple adjustable uh, what do you call this adjuster here and we have a uh, a um, a cheapest natural straps logo here on this hook and we have in on the middle section here this is a green colorway we have this loomed uh, loomed uh, color or fluorescent color which glows in the dark but of course it is not that bright so we have to properly charge it using a uv light switch i don't have right now but yeah i'm not going to be showing it today but i have done a review for this particular strap a few months or maybe one year back showing you that uh, awesome awesome loom in the dark or glow in the dark feature of this particular strap right so of course green color does match the military aesthetic of this particular piece check that out i just think this uh, monochromatic color of a of a field watch would uh, suit tons of water tons of straps that is available in my collection at least and i think you should give it a try as well right so let's go to the last strap which is my favorite military style watch <laughs> as of now right so this is the nylon or ballistic nylon strap from um vario singapore this features a simple quite a simple a uh, single piece um, um zulu style strap from uh, zulu style strap with a thickness of about maybe about 1.3 or 1.4 millimeters of course it's quite thick but the one uh, the major attraction for me is this sergeant patch here that gives it a whole lot of character right so i think they have it in black they have it in green and they have it in this khaki colorway as well but yeah just the khaki colorway plays really really nice with the military aesthetic that this one this watch has right so of course we have this fixed uh, keepers here and a sign vario buckle up top and when I use it on my wrist with on my skinny wrist, it just complete the military-ish look on the watch on this particular piece. And I just love how it looks, right? So I'm not a military guy. I've not been into a military training center, whatever, but I just love the aesthetic that this uh, strap gives to this military style piece, right? So check that out. Alright, so what do you guys think of my selection for this um, military military style watch from Carnival? So, of course, this watch major attraction is not only the uh, carbon, fi carbon fiber dial, it also has this tritium tube and I think this military uh, style strap does suits it uh, perfectly. And uh, what do you guys think of my selection? Again, so if you guys like this kind of video, please give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more future video reviews such as this one, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Until next time, I'll see you soon. Stay safe. Bye-bye.